Um, all right, and the first type we'll talk about sample. Sample dilution. Okay. Um, and um, on your um, um, lab there, um, we, get, we gave a couple examples of a simple solution. Right? If we took a solution and in there, in the example, we had two males of solution that had 20 particles in it so that it had 10 particles per male, right? It had 20 per two males, so it had 10 particles per male, right? So if we take one male and transfer to this tube, we're taking 10 particles, right? I know you can't read that, but that's 10 particles, right? If we take one mil um, buffer as our D went, then we're going to wind up with a total of two mils, right, that have 10 particles. So we have 10 particles per two mils, or five. per male. So we went from 10 per male to 5 per male, so our number was half. So we had one male plus one male, right? And so that was one male now to two, one male up to two males, so it's one half. So or one-half times 10 per mil gives us 5 per mil. So our dilution would be a one-half, a fractional form, so we multiplied our concentration initially, which was 10 particles per mil, then our resulting dilution gives us uh, 5 particles per mil. So that's a simple dilution. If we um, uh, did the same thing. We took a male, let me come over here, there's our one male um, in there, and we put it in kind of a shaky looking tube, but we're going to add nine males, a buffer, all right? So this one male still came from there, so it has ten particles in that one mil. So and our total volume then is going to be 10 mils. So we have one out of the 10, because we've got one over one plus nine, right? So we've got one tenth. So we've done a one tenth dilution. So this 10 particles in 10 mils is a concentration of one particle per mil, right? So if we started with 10 per mil multiplied by the dilution, then we wind up with the resulting concentration of one particle per mil. And I said particle, it's, you know, dilutions, it could be, you know, your concentration, your molar, um, you know, it could be, you know, one molar going to 0.5 molar going to one-tenth molar. It could be milligrams per mil, any kind of concentration. These could be cells. These particles could be in one million cells per mil. But this is the notion of a simple dilution. You're taking something of a concentration, adding some D, some buffer, and... Um, getting the resulting dilution of that.